Liebe Zuschauer, unglaublich, wen ich hier neben mir stehen habe. Er ist, ja, ich brauche eigentlich gar nichts dazu sagen. Ihr seht ihn, ihr wisst genau, was er gewonnen hat. Letztes Jahr das Big One for One Drop. Er ist ein absoluter Bringer und ich freue mich natürlich, because I get an interview from him. Daniel Coleman, it's very nice to meet you. How are you doing? Good, good. Yeah, first time out in the countryside in Prague. It's really nice here. Yeah, I had a good session yesterday. It's going good. Yeah, you played yesterday with the other guys, with Igor. A lot of people yesterday. We had Ike Hexen at the table. 5100. Was it for you? Was it spectacular or was it just warm up? Uh, I actually haven't played poker since PCA back in January, so I was a bit uncomfortable, you know, I haven't played in a while, I haven't been tuned up, but it was a con nice comfortable setting, a bunch of guys that I'm not, I know I'm familiar with, and it was just a nice enjoyable game. You know all of the other guys? Uh, there's a couple players that I think they won a satellite to get into the cash game, I wasn't too, I don't know. Yeah, yeah. Tobias Eckel was, right, the, right. was the qualifier and he was, yeah, but at the beginning he was very, it was very good. It was he was 20k up or something like that. Oh, was he? I wasn't paying that much attention, I guess. But yeah, uh, I didn't really get a good idea of how they were playing too much. But. And you had a lot of fun with the Lauden things and all the stuff. Igor Kuganov, yeah. it was his idea or something. Yeah, these guys are so bad. I beat them pretty good in Lauden things. Yeah. And you had this crazy room thing. Only food or something. How many days you could stay in this room? Yeah. You remember yeah. that? Yeah, this was for Ike and Martin was the brain. Yeah. And Martin gave some answer that was way out there. 86 days 86 or something days, like that. Yeah. And Martin's a sick guy because he goes, you know, for me, the first three days, if I did that, I would like it. I, I, would, I would almost pay to do this. You know, I'd enjoy it. <laughs> like, man. <laughs> yeah, you would think all about this mother, mother. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You would think about it his whole life. I'd be playing chess in my brain yeah, with myself. I don't know yeah. how is it possible. Is, it, is this not your first time in Europe, yeah? <laughs> no, no. I, I've been here. I've come here a bunch for poker since I was like 18. Going back like six years ago. So do you like it here? Uh, yeah, I like it in short stretches, you know. After a while I miss home, but yeah, yeah it's nice. Something different. What about the poker here in Europe? Uh, the poker, For you, it's not so? Yeah, the poker I've done really bad in Europe, actually. Apart from my success in Monte Carlo last year, I think I probably have the record for EPT main events of never cashing, never even making day two. I think I've probably played like 25. I've cashed, I've made day two once, never gone past that. <laughs> really yeah. poor. Monte Carlo, but Monte Carlo is okay for you. Monte Carlo is good. Last year, what? What was the result for you in the in the 100k super high roller? Yeah, I won it. Yeah, you <laughs> won it, won of it. course, yeah. It, and this time, maybe you won it again. Do you think you have chances to win it again? <laughs> Let's hope so, Jens. Yeah, you will. You will fly with all of the other guys to Monte Carlo. Right, right. I think we're going there in a couple of days. Okay, and we will hope you will get a, a good session tonight. And I see you have come. When I look at you, dear viewers, you see that John Daniel Coleman super durchtrainiert. You make some fitness at the hotel room or something like that. Me and Philbor, we actually got up. I actually woke up to Phil Bort knocking on my door. He's like, come on, let's go for a walk. You know, get up, don't go back to sleep. Let's go right now. So I was like, man, only because it's Phil Bort right now asking me to do this, I'm going to do it, you know? So we walked like 12 kilometers through the forest. It was nice though, you know? Feeling good. Yeah, Igor, Igor told me he was he was at the at the, at the forest and it was nice, yeah? Some, yeah? He saw some snakes and stuff like that. Okay, yeah. I didn't see any snakes. Saw some deer, but yeah, it was nice. So, and what will we see tonight in the live stream? What do you think? Uh, Maybe I'm some... Re, 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 straddles. Yeah, I'm like hoping that. so. I'm hoping the game plays big. People are loose getting in there, mixing it up. Yeah. The biggest pot, what do you think? Uh, Tomorrow? I, I really have no idea the stakes and who's playing, but there could be some pretty big pots, maybe 100k or I don't know. Wir sind gespannt. Ich freue mich. Sag danke, Dan Coleman. Thank you for giving the interview mm -hmm. for me. You're welcome. Thank you very much, Daniel Coleman. Danke fürs Zuschauen. Foto auch noch hier. Thank you very much. Yeah, you got it. Okay. Hopefully it's good. My English is <laughs> good. Ciao. What's like 1% of the list? <laughs> 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 Don't be shit about it. You can't go out on it. You're shit about it on the turn or the river. <laughs>
instead of this much, not hands here is this many. Uh, it usually doesn't get it here, it just gets it here. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. Right,